Okay, so to, one of the things we can do to help you reduce your risk of heart disease is to consider a cholesterol medication. Okay. Um, we've taken your risk factors for heart disease and calculated what your risk will be for the next 10 years, and it's shown here. Imagine 100 people just like you. What we would expect will happen to them in the next 10 years is that 50 of them will not have a heart attack, but 50 of them will. The ones that will are in red, the ones that will not are in green. There's no way for us to know if you're one of the green ones or one of the red ones. If um, we were to give then cholesterol medication to all 100, what will happen is shown here. You see, the ones that are not destined to have a heart attack will take medication but will obtain no benefit. The ones that are destined to have a heart attack, there will be 38 of them in red that despite taking the medication regularly will have a heart attack, and 12 in yellow that will avoid a heart attack because they took the medication. Okay. So there's no way, again, for us to know if you're one of the red ones, one of the green ones, or one of the yellow ones. Mm -hmm. um, but this highlights, uh, essentially, the magnitude of the benefit of the medication. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Um, so far, it sounds good, because I'd certainly like to reduce my risk of having a heart attack. Yeah, and there's 12 people that could benefit, right. and 88, you know, if you total the green and the red, mm -hmm. that will not. Mm -hmm. And th is that compelling enough for you to take That's medication? That's compelling, but what about side effects? Great question. Um, the statins are to be taken every day, so that, that creates a bit of a burden. Uh, they also cost money, but there are generics, uh, so those can be less expensive. So in terms of side effects, the two big ones are muscle aches, happen about 5 in 100 people, and liver tests that may go up, they'll happen about 2 in 100 people. Both of them are reversible. We stop the medication, they tend to go away. The uh, most severe one is muscle breakdown that damages the kidneys, and that happens in about 1 in 20,000 people. Mm -hmm. It's fairly reversible, uh, but you have to stop the medication very soon, otherwise it's big trouble. The way to handle this, if you were to get any side effects that you think are related to statins, you give me a call and we can discuss that. Okay. So what do you think? I definitely like to start, so yes. Okay. So I'll write you a prescription, but uh, please let me know if uh, this doesn't work out and we can okay. discuss other ways of reducing your cardiovascular risk if statins are not for you. Thank you.